danger water subject to sudden rise and turbulence when horn sounds proceed immediately to the shore jordan where the hell are we <laughs> me neither but it looks pretty sweet welcome back to the biggest spillway in nebraska i think i think it's one of the biggest ones hold on let's get this sign out of the way so we can take it in in its full glory but uh yeah i'm back to the spillway it's been kind of a staple of uh, my channel for a while and by a staple i mean i've fished here like three times or whatever and uh yeah you guys seem to enjoy it i love it here this is where i uh found out i liked fishing saw somebody over here in this corner catch a couple uh big giant flatheads and as a kid that uh didn't fish very much it was pretty cool to see so uh, yeah we're here we're excited stuff and things but pal what is going on you dirty old stash stains it is me it is jordan it is some guy that just caught a dang wiper right in front of us pretty excited but uh yeah this place uh used to be super good and it's starting to get good again they drained it i think three years ago maybe four years ago and uh, they drained it all the way down i'll throw up some pictures there's big pillars it's just 12 foot deep basically all the way across 12 is relative i guess water is kind of up right now but basically it's just a big flat bowl with a bunch of pillars in there and a bunch of giant fish there used to be 50 pound flatheads i know some 20 pound flatheads have been caught somewhat recently out of here and then there's just an absolute piss loads of wipers including the biggest wiper i ever caught i caught down here so yeah we already set up our tent that kind of smells funny and looks a little sketchy but we got our camping spot just right down the way and i don't know if we're gonna fish here for the next 36 hours but we're fishing for the next 36 hours and if it's going good it might as well be here so come on with jordan and i let's walk on down there and see if we can catch them stuff and things but found. all right jordan you ready are you scared are you excited are you more scared or are you more excited i'm gonna lock this we got too much shit in there all right try to get as close to the heavy current as we can without getting in other people's way luckily jordan works at a bait shop so we came equipped with some sunnies but yeah we'll have to try to uh, catch some shad i've caught some shad in the mouth here who remembers that that was almost my favorite time fishing ever catching chad on moss in the mouth hopefully this water's not too cold it was supposed to be like 90 today because it's july but for some reason it's only 65 and we should have brought muck boots and i say this every time but we did not bring muck boots all right this looks like about as good of a spot as any might have to put bigger weights on my catfish pole, but definitely looks like about as good of a spot as any. Man, I'm excited to be here. It's been a while and I don't know why. You want to put that on that bolt? Nice. Yeah, this is it, Jordan. Yeah, I about ate it. I'm gonna make a few casts with lures, but then we should probably get some live bait going. We might have to put bigger weights on the live bait poles than I thought, or yeah, maybe even go down to that table. But for now, I'm gonna chuck out the blade, Jordan. Uh, it's been a long time since I talked to you guys last, but I got something been fish swimming down this wall brought my live bait in dang it why is my camera always off when stuff happens please be a wipey but uh yeah just brought everything in it is a wipey it's a wipey it's a wipey jordan i got a wiper i got a wiper <laughs> I, th I thought for sure it was like a carp or something stupid but it is a wipey and it's not a shitty one. Okay, escalated quickly, escalated quickly. Old crawly boy produced. My line just kind of got tight and I thought it was a cart boys and girls. And we've been here for two hours. So my camera was just off. I was just dead sticking and gonna turn it on when I got a bite. I actually thought it was on. 
It wasn't, though. But that is a wipey dipey, which is what we're after. Not a shitty one either. Jordan saw some splashing down there, so he went down the way to try a top water. And just to kind of split up, you know. Somehow he swallowed it, even though I was holding it, but try to get it out and we got more hooks if we can't. Damn crawly boy. On the night crawler. <laughs> yeah. Right off the front. Why is he so stiff? I like broke his back or something. He's like got like rigor mortis going on. He just like gave himself a stroke. I've never felt that before. I can't bend him. He's stiff as a board. We might be eating wiper if he won't swim back. Feel it. It's weird. He's like tense. <laughs> I didn't even have a camera on like an idiot, but he slammed it. Well, we'll see if we can revive this guy. How do you even fillet that? First of all, he's skinny. Second of all, he's like bent. Have you guys ever seen that? He like curled himself up after about giving himself a stroke from fighting. I mean, I've caught some wipers and I've never seen one do that. Yeah, but he was like normal shaped. And then I got him up and he like, <laughs> he like <laughs> something happened to him. Alrighty, boys and girls. I got some bad news. And good news. We're eating wipey. Never thought I'd keep a wiper. I don't particularly like like white bass myself. I've never ate a wiper though. So uh, yeah, we need food. That's food. Not the food I was looking for, but it is food nonetheless. Old two split shot crawler off the side of the damn wall. I was just trying to catch something, you know? Trying to get on the board and um, yeah. Apparently this worked at least once. We might have to do the same with like the live bait, like just kind of lighten our weight up or something. I don't really know, but I just dropped it off to the edge of the wall and was holding it and nothing even happened for a long time. But when something happened, it just started ripping line out. Seriously though, comment down below. What the hell happened to Bud? He just like tensed up and died. Didn't fight him for that long. The water's kind of cool. Never seen that. Caught a lot of wipers and I've never seen that. Caught a lot of fish and I've never seen that on any fish. Is that a wiper that just swam by? I don't know. I don't know. Holy shit. Something is dumping line up. Got him. Got him. Big wiper. Jordan! Get over here! I figured something out! That happened again real quick. Now I gotta get down from this damn table. <sighs> I wish there was like a handle on this thing. That's alright. Seems bigger. Seems bigger. <laughs> oh. Seems bigger. Small circle hook, 17 pound fluoro. Live sunfish. Pretty big fish. Pretty big fish, whatever it is. Assuming it's probably a wiper. That thing just came up and slammed it so hard and I didn't even know what was happening. Sunfish right off the edge. Yep, sunfish though this time. No, sunfish. Seems bigger. Yeah, bud. Third, I dropped it off the edge. It's been hit three times in the past five minutes. I just missed them all. This one I wasn't missing though. It just came up and just started barreling line out, man. Yep. It looks like he's in the damn rigor mortis again or whatever the hell happens to him. And he swallowed the circle hook somehow. 
I mean, that's just what they do, but yeah, that's a healthier one for sure. Um, yeah, you never swim off. So we're eating them, Jordan, but we really want this one to swim off if we can get them to. And I might have you phone camera me if you'd be so kind. Let's see where he's got it first though. Wipey number two, only allowed one over 16. So we gotta try to get him back. I'm not sure how that works though. I might be able to give him to Jordan. I don't know why they keep just dying. Okay. There goes your dinner, Jordan. I'm sorry, but how does that work? Am I allowed to give you my, like you're allowed one over six, you're allowed 15 wipers and white bass, but you're only allowed one over 16. Can I give you a 16 to keep or do you have to catch it? Probably. And obviously in a situation where nobody's recording it, it's not a big deal, but when you're, when you're self incriminating yourself, those questions do arise. Um, I don't know if I'm on to something, but seriously, third sunfish bite in like five minutes. I just screwed up the first two. I am in fact not on this. <laughs> yeah. You caught a largemouth on a plopper. They usually, I've caught a few like one pounders yeah. here and there, but that was pretty sick. That was, I mean, 23 inches, 24, I don't know. Could have measured it, but all right, new hook back out and stuff. Got him. Got him. Got him. I tried the last one with a tight drag because I didn't want him to really swallow it anymore. He's also stuck on one of the pillars. Come on, bud. Come on, bud. He's stuck. So I didn't want him to swallow it anymore, but tight drag didn't work multiple times, so. Oh no. He broke me off on the pillar. <laughs> oh no. 40 pound braid snapped. We're just working out some kinks, you know? <laughs> Holy f That felt bigger, but man, wipers are just the best. They're so angry. All right. I need to take a deep breath, regroup, and I'm getting back after them. Screw the blade bait. We're double sun fishing. And eventually we need to go cook some lunch. I'm panicking, Jordan. I'm panicking. Yeah, he like shook the whole table, man. Do you see that? That thing, the sunfish was already freaking out and then he done rocked it. You can see they both started freaking out out of nowhere. There's probably just a school swimming through. Oh, wipey dipey, Jordan. Guess how many wipers I've caught here before? Two. One was six inches and one was like 13 pounds. So this feels good to catch a few of them. <laughs> Holy balls. He still got a sunfish in his mouth? Kind of looks like it. Oh God, he's under the table. Oh yeah. No, don't throw it. We need that. Oh, shit. <clears throat> yeah. Sorry, Reel. Sorry, sunfish bud. Sorry, wiper bud. He might be our second dinner fish. 
get him, Jordan. Get him, Jordan. Slamming it. Slamming it. You're going to have to tighten that a notch and try to keep him away from the, the stuff, but it's also pretty light line, so be careful. Dude, that thing just raw dogged it. And I don't know what to do with this guy. That seems bigger. I have no idea what to do with this dude. <clears throat> so we're going to do this for now. I don't know if he's 16, but I'm having troubles getting him out, and I'm going to go help Jordan. Ah. Pretty decent one, eh? Yeah, that's my biggest. Holy shit, it grew up. <laughs> Oh, sick, Jordan. And he didn't swallow it. And we still have a sunfish. And I'm messing it up. Oh. <laughs> That's like a 25 incher, man. That's an old, gnarly fish. Yeah, I can tell he was bit much bigger than we just slammed that. Thing. Yeah, that thing just destroyed it. Circle hook doing what it's supposed to do, finally. He's... I mean, he's hooked good, but... Mm -hmm. Dude, that's a giant. I'm gonna hold him in the water for you for a second. And I can get footage on my phone if you want. So you don't have to unplug it. And we need to get him back quick, so... Hold him in the water until I get it out and hold him tight. I don't know what setting I'm on, but it'll have to work. There we go. Finally, uh, Josh figured something out, and I was tired of not catching crap, so I came to join him. He was just dealing with one, and this rod just doubled up for me and spooled out. That was awesome. This is my biggest wiper ever. Uh, it was on Josh's rod, but count it. Still, I'll count it. That is awesome. All right. This one's going back, bro. Get him head first, and you might have to hold on to him for a second and kind of push him out. It's kind of hard in the current. I mean, that's like a seven, eight pounder for sure. Big dog. He looks like he's doing pretty good. There he goes. This one's trying to break my freaking pole over here. <laughs> Holy hell. I'm just going to cut it and see if I can get him to swim back. If not, we aren't going to waste him and he's going to be here over. You cool with that? Well, he's got a hook in him and a sunfish in him, but he swam off. This is going to be a mess, but a heater of a video, in my opinion anyway. It's a heater of a good time, that's all I know. I was down here for like, what, a half an hour waiting for a bite. I cleaned the dang wiper with a butter knife. <laughs> Takes forever. Cut all the red meat off. Oh, 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 yeah. it, it, which also took forever. Yes. Got him, I don't know why he stopped. Yeah, that was weird. He's stuck on something. He's definitely grinding on something, but I think he's out. That was weird, dude. Yeah, that was a weird bite for the rest. Yeah, they're coming back through, man. Do you have your drag loose? Yeah, maybe. Anyway, what was I saying? Oh yeah, I cleaned the wiper with a butter knife, sat here forever, nothing happened. I get back up to the truck, and Jordan's got one on old Blackie. Well, yeah, I was calling you anyway, but then I looked and I was like, maybe he's doing something and he won't answer. And I saw you fighting one. Anyway, I don't know where I'm going with this, but badass day. Yeah, I've never done real well here. I mean, I've caught bigger fish than these here before, but never this many. You've never been here, Jordan. <laughs> really want to keep that sunfish if I can. 
So fun. Wipers have to be the funnest fish around here anyway. Bite hard. Just bite hard too, man. All right. That's about enough of that. That took an embarrassing amount of tries to grab that fish, Jordan. That's the power of editing though. I can just cut half of them out. And he didn't swallow it. It's good. Yep. That one got a quick release. This one was doing something. Stuff is happening, Jordan. Look at that, he just wiggled down to the bottom. I don't even know what to say anymore, Jordan. You know how long it's been since I didn't know what to say? <laughs> Never. <laughs> this is fun. Anyway, we'll probably do a montage of us beating the brakes off him for a little while. We gotta go do some lunch things though. Eat old wipey dipey. I can't even get it out, Jordan. I can't even get it out. I was not ready for that. It's been a while. Got my shoes off, socks still on. <laughs> and he didn't seem real big, but he doesn't seem real small anymore. It's almost acting like a different type of fish. Or it's just a wiper that hasn't decided he's mad at me yet. Eh, it's definitely a wiper, I think. I mean, at this rate, what else could it be? Jordan, if I hop down here with no shoes on, am I gonna slip? Probably. Definitely a wiper. I hope so. The school's coming, Jordan. That was most definitely our liveliest bait we have left. <laughs> Yo. Why is my weight way up there? <laughs> All right. Man, wipers are so much fun. I mean, what's gonna fight like that? That we got anyway. Closest thing we got to a dang saltwater fish, Jordan. Hello, friend. Hello. Hello. I was hoping it was another eater, but it didn't swallow it. And it's just too big and beautiful. Sick. There's a drum. <laughs> Look at that pretty thing, Jordan. Keep on swimming, little friend. Keep on swimming. All righty, we are back. I maybe recorded some of the cooking stuff, but probably not all of it. But we got some blackened wipey dipey tacos i said i'd never eat a wiper jordan here we are eating a wiper comment down below i'm still not really sure what uh happened he like had a stroke or something i'm not really sure but uh but we got feta cheese we got homemade pico de gallo with cherry tomatoes if it's not cherry tomatoes it doesn't matter 
And yeah, where else was I going with that? Hot sauce, corn tortillas that are cooked. If they're not cooked corn tortillas, they're dog shit. You gotta cook them. Jordan, you want the first go ahead? Yeah, yeah. Take a bite. Have you ever ate wiper, Jordan? I know I'm asking this as you're taking a bite. What? I have not. I never have either. Have you ate white bass? I think so. I've ate white bass like once, maybe. A lot of red meat. I got most of it off, though. Oh, they're amazing. Are you just telling me that because I'm here and within reaching distance? Uh, 10 out of 10. Hmm. What did you season the fish with? Zatarans. Blackened. That's amazing. Yeah. It's not shitty. Jordan, do you know the Heimlich? No. Okay. I'm good. It went down. <laughs> All right. Well, thanks for watching. First time eating wipes. First time catching the shit out of wipes at the old big staple on this channel, Spilling Way. Shout out to a local guy named Ron. He uh, gave me some info on uh, how to not suck so bad. So. Couldn't have done this without you, Ron. Jordan uh, bought the bait, so couldn't have done it without Jordan. Jordan caught a couple, cut zero in his poles, but I caught zero on my bait, so if Jordan's don't count, then mine didn't count either. But yeah, wiper's pretty good. I'm not sure if I'll kill another one unless it's dying, but if I'm trying to revive one and it's dying, I'll probably just finish the job yeah, and, good. and eat its ass. But be sure to check out Jordan's channel. We, uh, we're gonna chill for a little bit. We're gonna make it back down there eventually and might try some other spots. But for now, we're gonna relax. Got up early, kind of midday lull, and we'll get back after it. Might have something special planned too, so stay tuned. Stuff things. But.